I'm Julie Blanner from the Lifestyle website, julieblanner.com. And today I'm back with another easy recipe. I'm sharing one of my most popular recipes with you. Easy lemon caper sauce. Now this caper sauce is so light and so refreshing, it's a taste of spring. That's one of the many reasons I think so many love it. It comes together start to finish in less than 10 minutes. It's so flavorful, yet so simple. This recipe is easy enough for a weeknight, but elegant enough for entertaining. It's extremely versatile. There are so many easy ways to mix it up, adding shrimp, scallops, or chicken. However, it's delightful as is. It's rich, it's creamy, and it's oh so simple and delicious. This lemon caper sauce is perfect to drizzle onto your favorite veggies, fish, chicken, or toss it with some fresh pasta. Any way you decide to serve it, you are sure to love it. This dish comes together with just a few simple ingredients. What you'll need to get started is a cup of white wine, lemon juice, heavy cream, parmesan, and capers. In a large saucepan over medium heat, bring white wine and lemon juice to a boil. For white wine, choose a white wine, including Sauvignon Blanc, Pinot Gris, or Pinot Grigio. Any white cooking wine will do as well. For lemon juice, fresh is always best, but you can certainly substitute 100% real lemon juice. That's typically found in the produce section of your grocer. Once it starts to bubble, reduce the heat to low. And stir in heavy cream. For heavy cream, it adds a little richness to the sauce. Reduce for five minutes, whisking occasionally. Remove from heat and stir in capers. For even more caper flavor, you can crush your capers with the back of a spoon before incorporating them into the sauce or while incorporating them into the sauce. You can add Parmesan now as well, or you can toss it with your favorite dish. I always recommend fresh grated Parmesan. It makes all the difference in texture and consistency. You can substitute Pecorino Romano or Asiago if you'd like. Toss with your favorite pasta, ravioli, or vegetables. Drizzle it on chicken, fish, and so much more. If you have any leftovers, you can store it in an airtight container, refrigerated for up to five days, but I doubt you will because it's just that good. This dish is perfect when you want something simple and light. A few notes about this sauce, it's not a thick, heavy cream sauce. It's anything but. It's a very light sauce that's packed full of flavor. If you want to thicken the sauce, you of course can by starting with the roux or adding a little cream cheese. 
However, I think you're gonna find it just delightful as is, as it's a very simple sauce that's very refreshing for spring and summer dishes. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to click subscribe, ring the notifications, and I look forward to seeing you again soon with more easy recipes.